Hey, what's up, YouTube? Ronix from Monus Photography. And today's tutorial is about the secrets to melanin skin tone color grading in Photoshop. Today's tutorial is about how to achieve those melanin skin tones in Photoshop. I recently discovered this important method of how you can achieve these beautiful melanin skin tones in Photoshop. So let, let me show you guys the before and after for this image. So this was the image initially before you can see how warm it was and yeah, before I can go ahead, this image was taken by Seyun Oderindi and I'm going to put his Instagram link in the description of this video so that you guys can check him out on his Instagram. So, as you can see, I already did the retouching for this image and if at all you'd love to know about how I do my retouching, I'm going to put the link right above here. So, this tutorial plays about how you can color grade and achieve those beautiful melanin skin tones for all your images in Photoshop. You can see... The image initially was a, a really warm image and yeah we're going to learn about how to color grade it to this look you can see before after before after you can see how it has turned out to be so let's uh, kick in enough of the talking and we start um color grading this image to get this beautiful melan melanin skin tone so let me delete this group so you can start from scratch so let's start by having a backup for a background layer by clicking Ctrl J on the keyboard or you can just click Command J for the Mac users or you can just drag and drop right here to duplicate that layer. So uh, we, we are first of all going to desaturate this very image. We are going to desaturate the image. So we are going to come right down on the adjustment layer and we are going to desaturate this very image. So come here and I click on your gradient maps so when you click on your gradient maps uh, it is going to transform your image to any color so you shouldn't worry about the color that is brought up on the very first step so click on this uh, red color thread so when you click on it it will bring these different presets so what you're going to do you're going to get a preset that is uh, close to black and white so this is the preset you are going to be using and if at all you don't have all these presets in your gradient map uh, option so you can come and click on this gear like icon and uh, you can click photographic toning and you can click append to get all these different swatches so we are going to be using the black and white uh, preset for this image so click on it so remember we want to desaturate this image so click on it and click ok so the image is going to be black and white as you can see so we're going to come right here to opacity and we're going to uh, drop down the opacity of uh, this very image so are uh, we going to leave it at around 38 i'm sorry if i'm really going to be extreme for this image because i want to show you guys uh how to achieve this look and i want you to clearly see everything we are doing so we're going to close this right here so right now we are going to cool down the image a little bit so we're going to come right down here and we're going to come to photo filter so when you come to photo filter just click on this drop down option and click cooling filter 82 so as you can see the image is really really cold or cool so we're going to uh, reduce on the uh, density of the amount of that effect to around five so right now what we're going to do we're going to come right down here and we're going to create a black and white adjustment layer so come and click on a black and white right here and we're going to come to the blending options and we are first of all going to use uh, we're going to first of all use overlay so when you click on overlay your image is going to really be a dark one so just come to the opacity and uh, drop down or reduce on the effect of uh, that particular option so you can see we are now getting to towards achieving those melanin skin tones so let's do this one more time so come back to uh, the options and now click and create another black and white layer but this time around you're going to uh, use the blending of multiply so when you click on multiply the image is going to be totally dark so come to the opacity and uh, drop down uh, or reduce on the 
opacity for this very image so you can see we are now closer to achieving these melanin skin tones so what you're going to do right now we're going to add a little bit of contrast to this image so come to your brightness and contrast right here and now i'm going to use legacy i'm going to add a little bit of contrast to this image I think to around one yeah because I don't want to overdo this so let's group all we have done for as uh, the melanin color grading for this image so shift and I'm going to click on this layer right here so control or command G to put this in a group so we can name uh, our group melanin so let's see the before and after so this is the before after before after you can see how beautiful uh, how we have gotten these beautiful melanin skin tones for this very image in just a few clicks in photoshop so basically this is how to, uh this is how you achieve those melanin skin tones in photoshop so if at all you love this tutorial don't forget to like this video don't forget to subscribe this channel if at all you have just landed on this video for the very first time and this image was taken by Seyun Oberinde. His Instagram link is going to be in the description of this video. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram at Ronix Photography. I'm Ronix from Ronix Photography. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in yet another retouching tutorial on this channel.